And while Canada's vaccination numbers are quite high, there's still thousands across the country who remain unvaccinated. For those hesitant to roll up their sleeves, a local clinic has been set up to answer questions and concerns some may have. Joining me now to talk about the Vax Facts Clinics is physician Dr. Latif Murji. Good morning, doctor. Good morning, Faiza. How are you? I'm good. So let's talk a little bit about what brought on this idea for Vax Facts Clinic. Sure. So we started off in about May for our own healthcare workers at the Scarborough Health Network, SHN. And it was such an overwhelming success to have our nurses and allied health speak one on one with the physician and have their questions answered that we actually rolled this out for our entire community. And we've been having Scar people in Scarborough calling in, um, getting their questions answered with the physician in a judgment free space. Um, and then now it's actually available to everyone in Canada because we're actually the first of our kind. This mm -hmm. is the first vaccine education clinic in Canada. So we're available for everyone. Amazing. So when you're speaking with uh, with people, what kind of uh, questions are you hearing? What kind of conversations are uh, medical experts having with Canadians? Yeah, a lot of people, uh, you know, it's understandable to have concerns uh, and questions about the vaccine. Uh, and a lot of questions are actually just about verifying the research process, verifying how we know that it, this is safe and how we know it's effective. So going over those studies and understanding how that works. Also understanding um, people have concerns about fertility, breastfeeding, and pregnancy. They want to understand why we know that's safe as well. There's also studies about that. And then a lot of people have their own medical conditions, their personal uh, allergies and medical conditions that they want to talk through and understand how they work and, um, and whether the vaccine interacts with that to make sure that's safe for them as well. So you're interacting with Canadians who have questions about COVID-19 and these vaccines. How many people would you say have been vaccinated um, since you started this initiative? Well, we've seen a few hundred patients at this point. Wow. And our success rate is actually 86%. So we're really proud of that. Um, so, yeah, you can do the math on that. <laughs> Oh, I don't know if uh, I can do the math on that, but 86%, <laughs> that's quite impressive. Um, and how do you help people? What kind of resources are you making available to people who might have questions? Because a lot of times, um, you know, these aren't people who are, um, you know, anti-vaxxers. They have legitimate questions. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so our approach involves first, you know, so this is a physician speaking with our patients one-on-one. -on -one. Right, so this is in a private, confidential, judgment-free space. And what we do is we actually first listen. We want to hear what the concerns are and understand the patient, understand their values. You know, everyone just wants to protect their own health and protect those around them. And they want to make sure that this is safe for them. So understanding where they're coming from, um, you know, for example, someone who's pregnant just wants to make sure that this is not going to harm their baby. And that's completely reasonable. Mm -hmm. So understanding those values and then offering to fill in knowledge gaps and then once we do verifying that the patient understands that information so it's really a back and forth and really getting to build a rapport with the patient and really understanding their values and, and sharing information in a safe and friendly and approachable way okay and at the bottom of your screen right there you can see the contact information for vax fax phone number and website dr latif murji thank you so much for joining us this morning Thank you, Faiza. Okay, time now, 7-11 a.m., Mel and Sid.